case where a student must have had a really bad day or they brought something in and uh, they didn't want to participate and they were um, and that's fine if they don't. I, like, I'm happy for them just to be there and be part of it, but they were actively sabotaging the rest of the group. So I actually took their jam off them and just asked them to sit there, just just to still be there, but they were they were just sabotaging the whole thing. It was really unfortunate. Um, and after that point, they they realised that it wasn't any fun without the jam and that's all I could talk about is the fact that I took the jam off them. And they're like, oh, you took the jam bay? I'm like, yeah, because you weren't working as a group, everything that we've been doing, you've sabotaged and you, you're not sabotaging yourself. Look at all your peers, they're not happy either. And um, I didn't have an issue after that. <laughs> so there was a student in year 12 um, who used to have some meltdowns, wasn't able to communicate very well and without getting the kids met. Um, kind of got herself into bits of dilemmas and situations that she couldn't get herself out of. But when she did drumbe, she found a little sense of confidence. Um, She's kind of really blossomed since then, to be honest. Yeah, and she's also part of other groups that I run, and she was able to take a lead role that she would never normally ever do. So I think that was because she got confident and um, gained some success to the drum beat. The last drum beat program we ran, I really noticed it, a change in the group dynamics. Initially, there was quite a bit of tension, and they didn't really care a lot about each other, and by the end, Principal even said when she came in, he said, "Oh, they get on all very well." And she was surprised how well they were connecting, and that change was pretty dramatic. And that was really, I think, quite obvious for me. Actually, we had this shy kid come in, and I was like, "Okay, it's a bit quiet." But uh, two weeks into it, because uh, we was playing a lot of rhythm, and we was just having a chat. They start to come out. They started coming out of the shell, so it was really good. Um, that worked really well, actually. Yeah, I was surprised myself, <laughs> and um, yeah, good results. And now he uh, he's loving it, up and talking, um, just mingling in with all the other kids now. So we decided to add the parents and the kids together just to see how the dynamic would go between the two. And it was interesting to see how the kids and the parents interacted with each other. Um, I found that it brought the parents to the level where the kids understood that the parents are normal and they're just human like their kids. So it, it broke all those roles down. So the role of the mother, the role of the father. And they just see them in those roles and yeah, it really brought them down to their level and the kids actually were teaching the parents how to be coordinated so yeah that was really interesting to see